Hi everybody, this is Chad the Gaming Dad, and today's video is all about the new game that just came out, Ace Combat 7 Skies Unknown. Yeah, it's not going to be unknown after this, we're going to find out all about it. So I've been waiting for this one for a while, for a lot of different reasons. Number one being that I love flying games, and I also happen to have a PlayStation VR and one of these. Yes, the Thrustmaster T-Flight Hotas. H-O-T-A-S. It doesn't stand for hot ass. Get your minds out of the gutter. It stands for hands-on throttle and stick. Yes, throttle and stick, both. It just still sounds dirty, still sounds bad. <coughs> it's a flight stick, okay? That's what it's all about. So, I thought this would be the perfect video to show off not only my hot ass, but also some VR on the brand new game, Ace Combat 7, Skies Unknown. So there's also one other thing that I made for an old Top Gun video many years ago, and a lot of people haven't seen it yet. So hey, why not use it now? I already made it years ago, not a lot of people saw it, so let's go get in my jet. All systems go, we're ready for takeoff. All right, everybody, here we are inside the hangar. It's amazing. Yes, right inside the hangar. But let's uh, let this thing do the boot system, hardware, whatever. We're just going to go through mission one. I've already completed it, but let's go do that again. Skip. Thank you. Air to air missiles. Yes. All right, so here we are inside the cockpit. Look at that, that's so cool. And actually, this is one of the better looking VR games on the PSVR, it's getting, they're getting better. The resolution inside this thing is not super, super clear, but they're getting better. Off we go. But as you can see, like we're in the cockpit, I can look anywhere I want to, all the way around. Down. I'm not that skinny. You can see a throttle over here, sticks here. Once we start flying, you'll actually see those move down there. All right, we are clear for takeoff, so throttle up, boom, there we go. And we're airborne, everybody. So this particular flight stick is nice because you've got your throttle on your left hand, you've got the stick for all of your flight in the right, but it's also got a twist. So instead of just using the rudders on the back of the throttle, you can actually just twist. See, you just twist and it and it goes. So let's see, where, where are we going, guys? Okay, start mission. Well, let's hope it does turn into a firefight. That's what we're here for. We can go all the way like this. And we're upside down, we're looking around, don't crash into the ocean, that's always a good thing. Alright, I see somebody on my radar, let's go get him. It does give you a little bit of that woo feeling when you're turning. We're picking up several unidentified aircraft. Omega 11, try contacting them via radio. Oh, slow down a bit. Aircraft. This is the IUN PKF. Unidentified aircraft has a radar lock on us. Missile. Missile. All right, let's go get some of these guys. Missile. 
crap. No. Don't want to fall in the ocean, guys. There they are. Fire. Wow. They're holding up against the big guns, guys. Destroyed now. Evasive maneuvers. I'm going after these guys. Switch. Ah, cool. Just in time to miss the missile. Fire. And these guys are doing well to get out of the uh, out of the missiles too. Destroyed. Get him! Ah, God, we got hit. Oh, we're good though. We're good though. Destroyed. Who else we got on our radar here? More targets. Man. Oh, we're getting good. We're doing it. Let's let's hit the afterburners here, guys. Whew. There is a button you can switch uh, normally to a third-person mode, but not in VR. Obviously, you're in in the cockpit. Switch with the guns. Switch missiles to the one that shoots a whole bunch at once. If I can get both of these at the same time, it's possible. You're behind on target kills. Oh, am I? There's one. All right. Who else do we got here? Enemy destroyed. It certainly was. This is Viper 2. I've arrived and we're the situation. Viper 2 and Rapier 1. Assist Mobius 1. All aircraft, rejoin formation. Where are we heading to, boys? This guy's the real deal. I can't stand on time with pilots. Such a candor. Let me too much. I'll be the judge of that. You really get a feel for uh, being in the plane when you're in this VR. It's so cool. What do we got? More more bad guys coming up? Let's head out this way. Let's get through this cloud. If you're in the cloud too long, you will ice up. I certainly can. Woo! There they are. Let's switch that gun. Whole bunch of targets. Come on, guys. I'm slowing down. Give me some more than just one. Done. 
this will alert. Damn. Didn't hit my chaff fast enough. I don't have that much, uh, I don't have that many chaff. Oh, damn. These other missiles do them off in one shot, but you gotta get a good lock on them. Love to get these guys both at the same. Doesn't look like I'm going to though. There's one. Come on, give me a lock. Boom. Wow, only have one flare left and one of these missiles left. Let's make this one count. There we go. There's no more of those kind of missiles. We're all out. We can get them with these. It's a hit but I don't think I killed him. There he is. Don't die. There we go. <laughs> That's always a good thing. Don't crash into the ground. Come on. I can't believe I'm missing so much. There he goes. Now we're behind him. That's it. Running out of targets. Do we run out of targets? Ammunition zero. Ammunition zero. Ammunition zero. No, we're good there. There is still another guy out there. Let's go get him. There they are. Not getting away this time. We have to do this. For who is this thing? Find the leader. I'm not leaving this party just yet. That position is insane. Get out. Woohoo! Almost ran into him. Man, we're just too close. You gotta get away from these guys so that you can fly in behind them. There we go. How's this guy doing? Missile, missile. Man, when you're coming right at him like that, it's tough. That one might have a chance. Yeah, hit. Get him. There he goes. Ash wasted a missile. Got him. Nice. Nah, he's not dead yet. Box two. 
I got him. Oh, don't get cocky, kid. That got him. Come on, missile. I got hit. Oh, shit. There we go. I got no more chaff. Man, these planes get... Hit him with three. There we go. Last guy, I think. One target remaining. Yep. Oh, that's a way to end it right there. Is that it? That's all we got. Radar's clear. The remaining free Erugian forces are withdrawing. Victory is ours. Woo! Mission accomplished. I just barely made it through that. Now here's the really cool thing. I don't want to spoil it. Let's wait. Watch all you like. There will be more battles. Until then, we rest. Return to base. Okay. So there is one other similarity from this game to the old NES Top Gun. And that is this. Landing requested. Oh, yeah. You have the option to skip it right there, but who wants to skip the landing? Hey, Wax guy, I will take it from here. Yeah. We're just gonna land this sucker right on... Now this is where having the, the hands on a throttle and stick, the HOTAS, is very helpful. Because you can put the speed down without killing the whole thing. I'm raising it, buddy. Uh-oh. A little bit more speed. Oh, call it. No, no! Oh! <laughs> Chappy! All right. The good thing you can try it over and over again. So let's let's see if we can figure this out. You gotta drop your speed down. I know. You drop it down to a decent amount, but you don't want to drop it too fast because then you'll fall out of the sky. So I got it lined up. Yep, we're lined up, buddy. Too low. Gotta pull up a little. Come on, man. Right there, right there, right there. Not like days. Gotta try it. Gotta get it this time. This is the Albatross Control Tower. Hey, Wax guy, I will take it from here. How does anybody do this in real life? And how do you practice this? And well, I guess there's simulators similar to this. I'm raising it, man. I'm raising it. I mean, you screw this up once in real life, that's your chance. That's it. All right, here we go. Line it up, line it up, line it up, line it up, right here. Bingo. Well, it sure was after the other ones blew up. Woo. So there you go. Some Ace Combat 7 in VR. This is a really fun game. I'm super psyched about this thing. Really glad I got this. This is amazing. Uh, that just feels so much fun. Even if you only get four missions or three or four missions, whatever it is, I'm going to play those over and over again because that is just really cool to play in VR like that. And then the rest of the game is great. It looks great. It's one of the best looking games I've played in a long time. Uh, so do yourself a favor. If you love flight games, make sure you get one of these T-Flight HOTAS. The HOTAS is the way to go. Always, always go for the hot ass. And then Ace Combat 7 is a great, great flying game. I'm having a lot of fun with it. So anyway, I thought that would be a pretty fun video. Hope you guys had a good time. And we will see you on the next video. But remember, until then, you never outgrow video games. My name's Chad the Gaming Dad. And thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one.
So long, everybody. Hey, thanks everybody for sticking with me and watching the entire video. I hope you liked it. The best way to help out the channel is to leave a like, leave a comment, and tell your friends. If you'd like to support the channel further, there are links in the description. But otherwise, always remember that you never outgrow video games. My name's Chad the Gaming Dad, and we'll see you on the next one. So long, everybody.